Hello friends, I hope you are looking for the best deli slicers. So you have clicked this video. In this video we will discuss deli slicers which are best sold and achieve top rated reviews from customers. If you want more information and updated pricing on the product, please check the description box in the below. So let's get started with the video. Number 1. Chefman Die Cast Electric Deli Food Slicer. If you find yourself cutting a lot of very tough meats, this is a great budget meat slicer. It's a low price, in the ballpark range of the Gurmia model above, with an average sized, 7.5 inches, blade and a very nice tray. It looks good on a countertop, with a sleek black coloring on the silver of the tray and blade. This feature doesn't factor very much into my analysis, but always worth noting, that an appliance won't make your kitchen look worse. The body is a sturdy die cast aluminum which can last you a very long time. If there's some kind of accident, it has a pretty good one-year warranty attached to it. The serrated blade is going to be the real deciding factor, on whether you want this or not. It makes the slicer significantly less good at slicing soft meats, it's likely to tear apart lunch meats, and anything softer you put in front of it rather than slice. Whether you want or need the serrated blade is the real make or break of this unit. You're paying a bit extra over the Gurmia for the privilege, and it doesn't do much of anything else special, save having a bit of extra power, it puts out 180 watts, giving it a bit more cutting force for those tougher meats. What we liked. Serrated blade. Sturdy construction. Good price. One year warranty. Nice aesthetics. Number 2. Besswood 103 Premium Meat Slicer. This is an excellent high-grade meat slicer that puts out more than enough power and performance for even the most demanding home user. The 10-inch blade is one of the more standout features, providing plenty of cutting size for all but the largest and heaviest meats. It will easily cut large, up to 8 and a quarter inches, slices of whatever your meat of choice is, as thin as you care to slice it, and up to about a half inch thick. The body is made of a sturdy aluminum, with nicely grippy rubber feet. It's safe to use, with a nice blade guard, while remaining very powerful, at one-third horsepower and 282 revolutions per minute. This is a highly versatile model, with enough power and speed to slice pretty much anything. Not just meats, but cheeses, bread, and vegetables are all fair game as well, giving you an all-purpose slicing machine for when you need to quickly crank out meals. The blades are a high-quality chromium-plated carbon steel, harder and sharper than a more standard stainless steel blade would be. Built into the top are a pair of sharpening stones, which lets the meat slicer's blade self-sharpen, even while in use, you never need to sharpen it by hand. You certainly pay a premium for it, this being one of the higher-end consumer available models, but it's well worth it for anyone that needs the best performing meat slicer you can find. The value of this machine can be understated, this is the best bang for your buck on the market. What we liked. High quality materials in the blade and body. Great power output. Safe and easy to use. Cut everything, meats, bread, vegetables, cheese, etc. Number 3. Ospa Electric Deli Meat Slicer, 200W. This model is almost identical to the Ospa model we already covered. It has a solid anodized aluminum body that protects it from corrosion, a must when dealing with meaty substances. The tray is a good size, though the blade is a bit small compared to some other meat slicers at 7.5 inches, while also being serrated, which is a bit of a minus in my book for something that only comes packaged with a single blade, if I had to choose one I'd take the smooth edge as it's far more versatile. The suction cups I'm still not a fan of, as I'd vastly prefer no slip rubber bottoms, particularly with this model's advantage over its weaker brother in the same line. The main draw of this meat slicer is its power, being a 200 watt model. While weaker than our winner of the Viver meat slicer above, it is also significantly cheaper than either, about a third of the price, and puts out an impressive amount of power for something at the lower end of the price range. For this alone it's worth recommending, as everything else is at least passable, with durable if cheap materials, like the stainless steel blade, and a high performance. The only real sticking point is that serrated blade. Features. Durable anodized aluminum construction. Good sized food tray. Excellent power output. Good value for the price. Number 4. Anesker 200W Electric Deli Food Slicer. The Anesker 200W Meat Slicer's standout feature is it comes with two 7.5 inch stainless steel slicer blades, both a serrated and a straight edge blade. The serrated blade is good for slicing raw foods and crusty bread, the straight edge for cooked and soft foods. 
The 200W motor is, in combination with the different blade choices, enough to power through the slicing of meat, cheese, fruit, veg, and bread, raw and cooked, so it's a truly versatile slicer. However, this is a reasonably powerful motor for such a small design, a good thing, so will create some heat, meaning it will need to be turned off every half hour or so, instead of running continuously. Cutting thickness is adjustable from 1 to 15 mm, not wafer thin, but thin enough for almost all foods, and a great thickness at the top end. It's light at only 10 pounds, making it easily portable to bring in and out of storage, and it has strong suction feet to prevent slippage during use. It breaks down into many parts easily for cleaning and sanitation. Overall it's a good little machine, with tons of positive reviews from previous buyers. Worthy of consideration, if you only intend to use a slicer infrequently for small tasks. Pros, serrated and straight edge blades to cut a wide range of raw and cooked foods. 115mm thickness settings. Suction cup rubber feet to prevent slipping. Comes apart easily for cleaning. Cons will need regular off time to keep cool, cannot run continuously. Number 5. KWS Commercial 320W Electric Need Slicer. We love the KWS 420W Slicer so much that we are recommending it again only this time with slightly fewer and smaller features and less power. Oh, and this one rings up $150 less expensive. Yeah, I thought you'd be interested. This is an excellent choice of slicer delivering commercial-grade performance at a home appliance price point. It's still considered a semi-commercial grain machine, and will have no trouble slicing meats raw, semi-frozen works best, cooked, cheese and vegetables. It wows you with the same beautiful sleek design as the 420W when you pull it out of the box. So what's different? It's lighter than its 420W relation, but still weighs in at a pretty hefty 39.2 pounds, like the 420W, it's not a machine you want to be moving around. If you love cooking your own bacon and pork joints, slicing up a pack of great deli meat for the week, or even if you have a small catering or food-related business, this could be an excellent choice for you. The price point is excellent for a machine with this much power, and even running it continuously for an hour, will not strain or overheat the 0.4 HP motor. So if you're looking for a top-of-the-line slicer but don't have room for the premium-grade KWS 420W, this could be a trusty workhorse for you that still delivers peak performance, and promises unparalleled durability. Pros: The 10 blade is made from high-quality steel with a nice smooth Teflon coating for easy cleanup. Generous size food tray 7.5 liters times 7 watts times 5.5 h heavy, non-slip and sturdy. The unit fits on a counter without taking up the whole counter. Cons, may be expensive. Thanks for watching this video. If you like this video, please like, share and comment on this video. Don't forget to press the notification bell icon to get new update videos. Also check the description box to check the products link.